Hey everyone, this is Trina from The Gaming Angel, and I'm this video we're talking about my new bags from Jujubee. So I used to be a Petunia addict, and um, kind of I don't know why I never looked at Jujubee before, but they have great bags, and they're machine washable, which is huge because uh, of how dirty sometimes these bags get, and the insides get um, just spills and all the stuff that can happen with baby and baby stuff. Um, and GGB also has a partnership with Tokidoki, and so these bags are super cute, and so had to get some. So I wanted to showcase um, some of the bags and what their uses are. I'll probably do packing videos going forward because I haven't really packed any of these, but I wanted to show you kind of an overview um, of my collection so far. Um, so this is called a fuel cell, and as you can see, it's got the cute... This one's a uni for unicorns fuel cell. Um, they call these characters the mama and baby unicorns. And basically it's got a pocket up here, zip pocket, and then there's the inside. And what I use this for is for snacks. So stuff this full of snacks. Um, not, I'm not as in love with it as I thought I would be. Um, it does, does hold all the snacks well, uh, especially when I take pumpkin over for daycare. Um, but it doesn't seem to hold the bottles very well um, in it. So maybe when you're just at like solid food snacks or cup food snacks, then this would be really good. Um, but I, but it's useful for now. Um, you don't need two, so this one will be going soon. Um, but it's the same thing, so I figure you only need really kind of one fuel cell. Um, also in that pattern, the uni pattern, I got Pumpkin her first backpack. And it's called a mini bee. And you can see it's got the straps. And um, there's a cute design on the back. And it kind of keeps cool. Um, so this will be for when uh, she's going to preschool or something. We can stuff it full of you know, the things that she needs, the various things she needs. Oh, and it's got a little purse, a little coin purse. That's really cute. Um, so yeah, that's, that's, it's really nice. Got a few, um, zippers and, um, a couple of pockets. This one's buttoned pocket. Probably would have been a little bit better if it was, um, magnetic for kids, but yeah, very cute. Um, along in that pattern, the uni pattern, I got the change pad, which is really nice. This is the memory foam change pad. Um, it's got the reflection, if you could see it. It's got their logo in the reflection, and it's a really thick change pad. Um, the memory foam is really soft. Um, the, the other day we changed dirt on it, and uh, it was felt really cushioned, and I really like it. I, if you know me at all, I have kind of the collection of change pads, which I was thinking about doing a video just so you can see all the different change pads um, and the reasons why I use certain ones, so I may do that in a future video so I can showcase those. Um, this, the other um, thing is, the other design is called Sea Ammo, and that's pretty a new, it's the newest design from them, and this is also a change pad in that style. Um, the Sea Ammo style, we got a Super B, and it's kind of a big duffel bag um, with lots of storage things. It's actually, it's actually humongous. <laughs> so, Initially, I bought it for um, for going to swim lessons with because, you know, it's got a cute, this is the messenger strap for it. Very cushioned, really thick, very nice. Um, bought it for swim lessons so we can pack all the towels and all the stuff we take to swim lessons. Um, it's going to replace the weekender that I have from Petunia, um, and I just think it's adorable and a really cute design, particularly for swim lessons, but I think we're going to use it probably all the time. I'm actually uh, giving um, the weekenders to another local mom uh, who's going to use that instead. So we're going to move on to that one. And I want to show you these. These are called Quicks. Be Quick. And this one's in the fairy tale. Um, I love the Beauty and the Beast in the middle. And uh, there's the Nutella in the corner. And on the opposite side, you have it without the tag. Um, and you can see a bunch of different characters. It's really cute. In this one, um, I have, it comes with the strap 
And this one I've done all kind of lotions, and you can definitely pack this more. I haven't really kind of figured out how I want to pack it, but this was for the other day. We were using it for the first time. And this is the C Ammo design again. Um, what's really neat is here the coral reefs on the bottom. You've got the mermaids, you've got the dolphin. Um, she's one of my favorite mermaids right there. Um, and when I open this one, this one is our uh, wipes and diapers. And I also have um, some uh, uh, A&D cream and stuff in case we need that. The cool thing is this wipes bag um, is really neat. So they've made a wipes bag. This is called a custom, and there's this whole world of like custom items that people make from the fabric of, well, they actually take the changing pads and they make uh, custom items, and it's really great. And this is all lined. Um, those are the, di di the wet, yeah, they're still wet, and um, it's lined, and uh, so it keeps your diapers wet, or your wipes wet. And I really like it. I actually am quite in love with this because otherwise, let me grab this. This is what you're using, and it's hard, and it goes takes up a lot of space in your bag as opposed to this, which is, um, well, it's about the same size, but it's bendable, it's flat, it's a lot thinner, and it holds just as many wipes. I have the same amount of wipes that I have in this. So it's great. It gets great in the bag. And particularly... Um, this will be great to have it in the quick when, uh, you know, when I'm carrying stuff. When I used to go to Mommy and Me and I used to have to carry her in one hand and try to carry a diaper and wipe and, and this and the other, uh, this is just one thing. Carry her, go over to the changing table, done. It's great. Awesome. Absolutely love it. It's one of my favorite things that we got. Um, this is also another custom, and it's in the Annie Crip print which is really cute because it's based on the zoo and there's on and, and the giraffe. We love giraffes. Um, this one has a custom little pole thing. And I haven't quite figured out how to pack this yet. Right now it's kind of got sunglasses and this is an emergency kit. and um, It's got tweezers, but there's the lining. And um, so I'm still looking for ways to pack it. For me, it's not as um, nice of a bag. I would have liked a little more structure, but someone said it's because it uses the uh, light changing pads versus the thick ones. Um, so it, it may be good. It may be um, something for flats or, you know, we'll, we'll see when I do a future boxing video what I actually uh, pack in this. We'll see. Next up is the GGB, and this is called Toki P, and it's kind of uh, their hard to get design. And this is called Be Neat, and it's their, uh, I guess, a uh, bib. And these are my favorite characters, the cactus babies. Look how cute. And on the back, this is Star, and it's got the catcher, crumb catcher. And uh, the thing itself is magnetic, which is great. And um, this fabric is retired, and so it's incredibly difficult to get. Um, so when you find it on the resale boards or whatever, everyone's trying to get it, which is, it's really fun. I love the colors. I love the uh, designs of it. I kind of wish they would bring it back because it's really cute. Um, and it comes with a little pouch bag to keep it in. So it travels really small. It's pretty awesome. Uh, this is not used yet, but it's in the same, uh, let me take out the bag. In the same fabric as a Toki Peak, if I can take it out of the bag. And it's called a booty pad cover. I think that's how you say it. But there's this uh, wipes pack underneath, and it holds wipes. Cool. Um, and it's called a booty bag. And so it uh, holds the wipes in there. And then you've got this case cover. And so it's got the design. And you can swap out the covers from the inside, or you can wash them separately. And um, again, it's got the matching pull. It's, it's really pretty. It's got the characters on it that you love. Um, love this. Uh, sewn really well. I love the custom. I love that there's this whole community of people who make custom items. There's people, there's things called an ouch kit, there's key fobs, there's just tons of useful things that you could use other than just the diaper bag itself. And so we'll be showcasing some of those things I find because I'm kind of obsessed with that. And then last we have is uh, the uh, little coin purse 
We've got a coin purse. There's a little mermaid. Love her. Um, and a lot of people with these coin purses, they actually take off this um, tag with a seam ripper so you can see the design underneath because this tag is huge and the designs are so cute but it totally covers up the designs. Um, I may do that too because I kind of really like this design but we'll see. Um, so that's my little obsession right now and I will show you again how I pack these or as I use them um, they're all still fairly new to me um, and see how we get the most space. Um, let me know what you love about GGB if you love GGB and what your favorite custom products are and uh, yeah thanks for watching bye